Hello everyone welcome to creating folder lesson. The folder is used to group, to organize, the body or sketch in our design. In our design area, I have created a toy train. It was composted by four wheels, a body, a headlight in front, a roof on the top and two rear lights at the back. Click the wheel in the item manager. Click the arrow and drag to move it. The other bodies of the train aren't followed because the bodies were not grouped to make it easy in moving, rotating or scaling the whole train. We should group the bodies. To group means creating a folder. To create folder, click create folder in item manager. The empty folder is created. Click three dots. Click rename. I rename wheel. I will keep the wheels in this folder. Click and drag to move all the train wheels. I create another folder. Click create a folder. Click three dots. Click rename. I rename the rear lights. Press enter to confirm. Click and drag all the train rear lights to move into the folder. And then I am going to create one more folder for the train body, train roof and headlight. Click create a folder. Click three dots. Click rename. I will rename it to the body. Press enter to confirm. Click and drag all the bodies to move into the folder. Now you could see the bodies are organized in the different specific folders. You could hide or show the bodies in the folder by clicking the fisheye icon to toggles. You could also move the bodies in the folder by clicking the folder. Click the arrow drag to move. Or click the curved arrow and drag to rotate if you want. Finally, I will create another folder to keep these three folders. Click create a folder. I rename it train. Click the folders drag to move. The train bodies are grouped in a folder. If you would like to go through the bodies, click the arrow. There are three folders in the train folder. If you would like to move to rotate or scale the whole train, Click the train folder to select. Click the arrow and drag to move. All the bodies are moved and followed. And the rotation also.